like 20k on my bitch and Fenty. This a no flag zone, yeah, Slim Jimmy. This a codeine zone, yeah, no rim. I flip the money, I feel like an acrobat. Don't come your home, shit kill, I rim rattle that. Chopper go rat attack. I shoot a movie, no cinemax. I spend the money, then make it back. Say I'm broke, bitch, you been lied to. Huh, niggas hatin', pull up on them like a drive through Give them a demonstration. With my sack, yeah, with my. What's good, y'all? White Boy Entertainment, and today I'm about to show y'all the best demigod shooting lockdown build in the whole game, bro. I know y'all probably think I'm gonna, probably y'all probably think I'm gonna do some rebounding wing type shit, nah. But I was, I'm not gonna lie, I was trying to, but I came up with this cheesy ass secret. I don't even wanna tell y'all. It's a perimeter. I'm gonna tell y'all. It's a perimeter lockdown, and I don't know how I got it, but I was tweaking with this, bro. What's I don't know. Let's just let's get into it. Come on, let's 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 get into it, bro. I'll explain later, but just trust me, y'all. But if you really want to be a cheesy shooting defender, then you come to the right place, bro. So you want to get the red and green pie chart, shooting defense. And if you watch Poor Boy Sin's rebounding wing video, he says pick this one. He's a fucking idiot. Do not pick that one. Pick this one because you literally get way more vertical for rebounds, way more strength for big bodies, like all that kind of rebounding shit, and your speed is eh, a little bit lower. So trust me on that, y'all. Basically, you max out all the defense for sure. But there's little loopholes. You know there's always little loopholes where you nudge down a few attributes and you get some more. So what you're going to want to do, so he has 20 defensive badges, right? And we all know defense rebounding should always be higher than offense. So what you're going to do is you tweak this down, tweak this down to 72. Seven, no, you tweak this down to 73. You, I mean, honestly, four on a defensive rebound, I mean, offensive rebound doesn't really matter. And I keep my 20 badges, so that's what you want to do. Everything else, I think you can't take anything else down, so that's the best thing to do. Keep everything else up. Complete Clamp God. Yeah, and this is not even the- bro, I'm telling y'all, whatever stats y'all think now, just wait till the end of the video, and it gets crazy, bro. Nobody's really doing, like, what's it called? Nobody's really doing their fucking, like, playmaking badges, because it's impossible to get a full set of playmaking badges, unless you have, like, two full things with pass accuracy and shit. So what I did was I put my ball hitting on- I had it on 50, but I put it on 60, because I was thinking that you can't have no dribbles, so... I might put that on 55, but I'm thinking of 60 ball handling. Okay, and then you come down here. Definitely max out your driving dunk. Driving layup. And there's the part right here. If this is up to y'all, to the best build I found was if you want most, I think it's more important to have a finishing badge over playmaking when you're like a shooting defense kind of guy. You want to finish. You don't need to be able to have an extra quick first step badge. I mean, if you do, that's you, but it's way harder to get. I think all you need is a little bit of ball handle, and then you come up here and tweak this. And you get your defense badges. Wait for it. You lower that down too. Hold on. Extra finishing badge for no reason. Y'all see this, bro? Y'all need to drop a like. I'm really putting y'all on, bro. For free, too. For free, I'm putting you guys on. So y'all see this right here? Best sharp, bro. Best sharpshooting defender badge. I mean, I said badge. Best sharpshooting defender build in the whole game. Y'all have to trust me on this, bro. Insane build. I'm telling y'all, bro. And just wait. This is not even crazy part. If y'all worried about sending dunk, don't worry. Don't worry. All right. So this doesn't matter. But I watched this video and it said built is how you get buff and ripped. So what's up, Carl Malone shit? And this is the whole point of the video right here. I know y'all are thinking I have to be tall and shit. But y'all, bro, look at this, bro. Look, watch. Just watch. Oh my God, bro. Look at the difference. Look. Strength. My speed goes up three. Acceleration up four. And vertical up four and I lose two strength that I get back when I put my weight up my three-point shot goes up point bro Do y'all see this that free throw that I took down earlier right back more ball handle a little bit of pass accuracy I literally get plus three defense That's more I get a better steal. I get an 82 steal a 73 lateral quickness bro, and I lose one we can lose one block and one rebound bro and a little bit interior defense That's all right because our block is still an 81 Y'all aren't, f bro, and our three, when we hit 96, we'll have 83, bro. This is the best build in the game already, bro. Besides my scoring machine, this is the best defensive, and my driving dunk and layup goes up. Bro, I'm telling y'all right now, y'all either make this build or y'all are missing out right now, bro. I'm sorry, bro. It's the best build I've ever seen. Look at this. So definitely make your dude 6'6". Six, six. I get plus one strength, so in the end, we lose one strength. And I get my interior defense to a 70 for no reason. I don't lose anything. Look, I lose nothing. The best build in the game. Look, my strength is down one, and now my speed's up. And I'm an inch shorter. 
I just got, I almost have an 80 speed, and I don't even have the fast pie chart. So, poor boy Sin, whatever you're talking about, just know that I am making the best defender in this game right now. Oh my god, let me calm down, but look. So, what you want to do, you get that plus one strength, and I just do that because I want the most weight before I lose acceleration. So, 216, you want to be 6'6", 216 pounds. Let's get it. Wingspan, um, it's actually the trick of being 6'6", is that, look, look, you down one, nothing happens at all. So, I think you're better off... I'm gonna leave mine. I didn't have this fully ready. I guess that plus that does look that 83 does look good, but you gotta remember that you do want a defensive build. So for y'all that don't really want to have a like crazy defense, I know that doesn't. It looks like a not a big sacrifice, but that short arm is gonna be a big deal. So I'm gonna keep mine right here. That's that to me is wonderful. 80 mid range, 79 three. Look at that defense. That's fucking ridiculous. So. It's up to y'all. I would leave my arms how they are perfectly. Maybe even a tick up. If y'all are like, yeah, that's up to y'all. But I would leave it right here. That's perfect. So, yeah, let's get it. Regular arms. And, y'all, for this part, this is actually tough. I want to get sharp takeover. But, ah. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and get lock takeover just so I can be cold, bro. Lock takeover. Y'all know what it is. Best build in the game. Let's go. Perimeter. Fucking lockdown. Look at that build. The best build in the fucking game. Let's go. Y'all see what I'm doing, bro. I just spent 50k BC for y'all. I don't even make money off this YouTube shit yet, but y'all know what I'm doing. I'm, make, I'm out here throwing in my money for y'all. But y'all drop a like and a sub. I'm probably not going to throw any gameplay in this video just as I'm just showing y'all the build. But do trust me, bro. Expect a bunch of gameplay videos. I'm going to grind this dude right after this video. But y'all drop a like and a sub. Love y'all. Comment if this build's good for y'all. Comment if you even made it. But yeah, love y'all. I'm out.